Welcome back, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me today at the Bugle Bungalow. Gutsy Hunter here with you to bring you Ultimate Fishing. I thought we'd start a new uh, season of uh, Ultimate Fishing from the beginning, for those of you who have not seen the game before, or just a little curious of how it works and, and uh, the game mechanics. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Uh, difficulty level, I usually just do normal uh, for new players. Um, but if you like to get into more serious fishing, the uh, realistic will go ahead and eliminate the bite indicator, hunter vision, and the underwater camera. Gives you that more realistic feel, I guess you could say. So, and of course they have sandbox where you can just go ahead and hit all the fisheries. So, but let's go ahead and jump right in. Oh. Do this as uh, our YouTube, since this is our YouTube videos. All right, let's rock and roll, everybody. Little tutorial here. Welcome to the fishing simulator. First, look at the player tab and equipment screen. Then check out the fisheries. All right, <clears throat> so moving around standard, WASD. If you want, and then you go to the casting. Precise cast is the right mouse button. Or you can do far casting by holding the left mouse button down. Real. Left mouse button. You can extend it by pressing space. That's more for float. Um, reeling speed is shown. R and F changes the reeling speed. All right. So of course, then we learn about the fight. Netting. I'll let you guys read through this if you want. I'll just kind of go through it. A little slow there. They got the good old fly fishing there. Fishing techniques. Straight and slow, which is just a very slow and continuous dragging of the bait. Straight, same method as one before, but slightly higher reading speed. Lift and drop. Stop and go. And twitching. And we can get boats later on. Rod pods. Bottom fishing. Do some trolling. And skills we'll cover as we go into it. Equipment. So on and so forth. Let's go turn off the online radio because I'm afraid uh, I don't know if it'll do anything there. Alright, I think we are ready. Let's go check our skills. We don't currently have any skills. You can see we got to get to level two on a few of them. So have $150 inventory. So currently we have a level one spinning 2.2 kilogram durability. Our line is 0.4 kg. Oh, it's really light. Looks like we have a size 4 hook, 1.7 kg durability on the line, or on our reel, and our bobber, and we are currently fishing with flies. So let's go ahead and I'm a little more concerned about the line. So our line definitely is going to be our weakest spot. I don't think I can... 1.3 would be a little bit better. 
That's a level two, it looks like. I don't think we can buy it yet. Okay, well, let's go ahead and uh, get to it. So our first starting lake is going to be Betty Lake. Uh, species here looks like we can go rainbows, browns, brook, bull trout, cutthroat, burbot, eyed, and pumpkin seed. All right, let's go see what we can do. Let me take a drink of coffee while we're loading in here real quick. Not too many techniques to do with the uh, float rod, unfortunately, but we'll have some fun with that. Alrighty, as we can see, we can move around. Looks like we've got a couple other fishy, uh, fishermen, fisher ladies with us. I don't know who they are. But we've got quite a few over here, too. Alright. Let's go ahead and just head on over here to a spot. Okay. Teach us about the precise cast. Right up here to the water's edge. Teach us what we've already read. You can see that there's a menu over here to the left, bottom left. Um, if you want to see, one of the things I find it interesting to make the game kind of fun is the uh, the camera. We can change our view. We can actually see what's happening underneath the water here. Do a little right click, and you can actually kind of jerk that around. We may not be up far enough right now. So we'll push C again. Let's get that reeled in here. And we're going to go hit one of the pegs. Uh oh. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw out our rod here. There we go. Get that out there a little further. Do a little right click here, kind of move it around every so often. That's some fish in the area, but we might not be deep enough. Oh, oh, here we go. Here comes our first fish in. Watch the bobber on the right here. There we go. Oh. So we need to loosen the drag here a little bit. Make sure we keep that tension out of the red as much as we can. Right now it's just about tiring him out. And there we go. Our first fish. Now you can uh, make the choice to either cake it or release it depending on what we want to do. So, so it is a four kilogram rainbow. And we're going to go ahead and sell them because we need a little extra money right now. So $62 right there. Hook size will uh, change the attraction, weather conditions, and luring method. All right, let's get it back out there again.
A lot of rainbows down there. We'll just kind of catch a few fish here until we can get to a point where maybe we can do some upgrades of our our equipment here. Looks like we got us a pumpkin seed. Little point one six kilogram, huh? We'll go ahead and sell him for the big three bucks that he's worth. What else we can attract here, huh? Now as we move through other spots in the lake, uh, different points will hold different fish. Uh, so we'll go ahead and we'll hit another one here in just a moment. Oh, what do we got here? Let us see. An eyed, huh? Nice. We'll sell him for that $3 as well. Okay, let's go ahead and mark our map. Let's see here. I think there was a map, wasn't there? Tap. No. head down here a little bit. I find down here at the other little lake on Betty Lake here is usually where you're going to find a lot of the cutthroats. All right, let's see what we got here. Good size eyed right there that was down below. Watch our marker. There we go. Kind of do a, a pumping reel type action so we don't get the red too much. There's a nice little bull trout, $32. See what else is out here. Clicks here, see if we can. That looks like a big old brown. Oh, 
drag down on that one a little bit. I get him turned around here. I want to spool us. Bugs are going crazy. Browns are a lot of fun to to bring in here. They're probably so far the heaviest fighting fish that I've dealt with on this lake. Look at that. Two kilogram brown trout. $33. We'll sell him. And there we go. We just hit level two. So now, let's see. Uh, so now we go to our skills, and we can choose what to unlock. Um, because we're not going to really do any ice fishing quite yet, we're going to hold up and uh, hold off on that. Um, usually, what I like to do is either strength or uh, more experience. And I think because we want to level up a little bit quicker, let's go ahead and uh, do more experience for right now. We haven't really hit any monster fish that would take us um, to a point where we're in trouble. So, all right, we're at the map here, and you, so to access the map, you hit Escape. That brings up your menu, and up here in the upper left, right here, you can see that that is uh, the map icon. I just click that, and you can actually click on one of these pre-select flags or uh, tags, and it will go ahead and. Uh, you can quick travel to it. So that's why we're here right now. There's a little butterfly in our face there. Nice, nice. Let's go ahead and get our rod out here. Let's see what we can attract over here. Usually I get a lot of cutthroats in this area. I like using the camera just because it adds a little new feature to it. So makes it a little more fun. Okay, one second, guys. Let me turn off my preview. It seems like we're getting some... Serious uh, lag there. Hopefully that'll smooth out the video. Oh, what do we got here? Another brown trout. Another $32 right off the bat. We'll take that. All right. <clears throat> so what we're going to do real quick, let's go ahead and upgrade that line now. So it's going to take a big chunk of our money, but uh, obviously you can see that the durability is a, is a heck of a lot more there. So let's go ahead and buy that. We'll equip it. And I think, let's see, how are we doing on hooks? Size 4. I'm okay with the size 4 for right now. And let's go ahead and go to baits real quick. Let's go ahead and let's buy a few maggots. I think 10 maggots will work good there. Okay. So basically we've got everything again. All we've done is upgrade that line. And then also we added some maggots. So let's go ahead and see what we can do now.
Give it a little wiggle wheel. <laughs> All right. Apologize for some of that frame loss uh, that you guys will probably see in the playback of the video. Uh, not sure what was going on. The video card was just having some issues, I guess, so. Seem to have anything interested right there in the maggot, so let's go ahead and move it around. Let's get over close to that rock there. track something here. Ooh, somebody just got a 15 kilo rainbow, huh? Nice. Swam by there. Oh, we have somebody coming up here. That. Oh, nice little brick trout. Sell him up. Make some money. See some fish working up right around here, so let's go ahead and see what we can do. Gotta take her. Second eyed. Nice little eyed.
All right, let's see here. That looks like we're maybe we're banging against the rock there. I think we are. <laughs> We'll catch a couple more fish here, and then uh, I'll show you the <clears throat> what the trophy room looks like and how to access that as well. I think eventually we'll want to uh, definitely start upgrading our equipment. Go ahead and move this away from the rock just a little bit. I don't know if that's <clears throat> causing us some issues there or not, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. Come on. It seems like the bite rate on that maggot right now is a little slower than it was on the fly. Catch someone's attention here in a moment. We'll go ahead and let's bring it in a little bit further. There. Oh, there we go. Other eyed. It's going to be a little bit bigger, it looks like. Now your records, uh, your trophies are automatically sent to your trophy room, so... Nothing special you need to do about that. <clears throat> oh, look at that 1.2. 5, huh? A little bit bigger, we'll take that. Okay, let's go ahead and switch back to the fly. Let's see if that... Makes any difference here. If we don't need to buy it, we just want to equip it. Oh, I forgot to mention. So here's where you can adjust your float length. So, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, so it starts at 50 centimeters. If you want, you just click and drag it. So, like, if we want it to go 100 centimeters, let's go ahead and try that a little deeper, see what happens. Cast out here where I know it's a little deeper. You can see by the angle of the camera, we're a lot deeper now towards the bottom. Let's see if we can get uh, some trout here to take a look at it. And, you know, the other thing I didn't think about, that yellow line actually might... Ooh, that dude went zipping by us. Uh, it, that might actually cause some issues, too, because it's a little more, quite a bit more visible line. We got to take her here. Like a small eyed.
Not a big fighter, only three dollars. Yeah, we'll throw him in there. Oh, we got a little rain now. Little active weather going on. Nice uh, like cutthroat. Oh, I got a brown going after it. If I get him turned around here, we'll do some <coughs> quick reeling here. You see the the difference in the fighting style between like a brown versus some of the other fish that we have available there in the uh, lake. We'll get him in here. But he's taking his. Uh, Sweet time there, he just decided he's gonna come in now. So there we go. 2.2 kilos. Look at that. It's a good looking. Good looking fish. Sell him for 35. Let's see what else we can get while we're right here. I'm trying to get to level 3 so I can show you... One of the things I wanted to show you in this video is... Certain things open, obviously, at, at uh, certain skills, open up at different levels. But I wanted to show you that you don't have to necessarily spend that skill point in the new level if you don't want to. You can go back to the upper tiers and still uh, play skills in that. So I was going to try to show you that. I think we're fairly close if we can get a kind of a decent fish here. Me. While we're waiting, let me take a drink of my coffee. I'll be right back. All right. Oh, well, what have we got here? Not a big, big fish, but nice little bull trout. $32, let's we'll sell him. There we go, we hit level three. Okay, just what I wanted to show you guys. So let's go ahead and exit uh, escape to get to the main menu again here. And we'll hit our skills up. So you can see we unlocked um, the ability to use boats. But you don't necessarily have to jump right into that. If you think you're going to, like for example, I'll, we'll probably stay at Betty for a little while. So let's go ahead and all that 10% that in store might be... Uh, because we are going to do some upgrades. So let's go ahead and do that one. The next one we'll focus on is uh, on our next levels is to unlock the strength one. So, All right. Well, let me go ahead, guys. And uh, to wrap up this video, like I said, let's go ahead and show you the trophy lodge here. Uh, I just got to remember which one it is. Not the leaderboard. This you can see, you know, the biggest fish, 20. These are kind of show you the leaders in the game. We're down at 1,394, which, you know, that's all right. That's all right. Uh, is it Sander skills? 
Under inventory, where did it go? Also, while we're right here at the map, you can advance time if you need to as well. So if you find that your bite is uh, not going the way you planned, you can advance it by clicking the plus sign here, or you can go ahead and hit that minus sign. And you kind of get a <coughs> snapshot of what you've done. So we caught 12 fish total for 17.36 kilos. We caught all 12 of them. Our biggest one is 4 kilos. And you can see the species we caught right here. Oh, no, that's the species in the lake, sorry. All right, so let's, is it back of the main screen? It must be, must be. I haven't played this in a while, so I apologize. Let me exit back here and see if it, get to the truck from this way. Yep, right here it is. So a little fish on the plaque, so from the little lake launch screen. So we go to our trophy room. That's some cool music, a little rustic look about it. So your fish will be scattered throughout, you can you come right up to them, you can see it and tell you the weight. And these are automatically upgraded every time that you catch a, uh, a new trophy. There's our bull trout. Like we got a fish up in the upper stairs, we'll head up there. There's our rainbow. Let's see what this one was. Everything I've seen, from what I recall, like this is the what I would call the trout room. I haven't seen any other species go in here besides trout. Our eyed, any pumpkin seed should be, I think, in the other room here. So we'll take a quick gander at it. Back down. Oh, there's, I think, our eyed. Yep. And our pumpkin seed. I'm not sure where he is. Oh, right here he is. There you go. So everybody, that was our first uh, episode of Ultimate Fishing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, if you haven't uh, or would like to, make sure to hit the subscribe button on the channel. I'd love to have you become part of the community. And I will go ahead and leave the links down below also for our Discord. So I would love to have you be in there and chatting with us. And I will go ahead and wrap this up and catch you on the next video. And until next time, everybody, take care.